Hello, welcome po sa vlog ko. So, sa video po na ito is tuturuan ko po kayo kung paano mag-deposit ng coins sa crypto.com gamit po ang coins.ph. So, una po is buksan po natin yung coins.ph natin. So, once na nabuksan na po natin yung coins.ph natin is ma-observe nyo na meron po tayong 4 options for cryptocurrency. So, yung BTC, ETH, BCH, at XRP. So, uh, bali po, yung i-convert po natin na uh, coins is uh, XRP. The main reason is that sa XRP po is mababa lang yung uh, transaction fee. Kasi po sa BTH, ETH at BCH, malaki po yung spread niya sa market. And then yung XRP naman po, uh, sakto lang. And then yung pag-transfer po sa coins.ph to crypto.com is mura lang po. So, una po is convert muna po tayo ng XRP. So, click natin yung convert. So, sa convert is you will receive XRP. So, click natin dito is sabi natin 100 lang. For demo lang. So, ito. 10 XRP. So, slide po natin. Confirm. So, nakapag-convert na po tayo ng uh, 100 pesos to XRP. So, nagkaroon po tayo ng 10.74. So, pumunta na po tayo sa XRP. So, makikita nyo po is meron ng bawas, 98 pesos na lang po. So, ngayon, ang next step is to transfer this XRP to Crypto.com. So, yung gagawin po natin is... Open po natin yung Crypto.com. And then, click natin yung Transfer. Sa Transfer, you have two options. Deposit at Withdraw. And then, choose Crypto. So, Deposit Crypto from other platforms. So, marami po yung nandito ang cryptocurrency na pwede nyo i-transfer. So, look for Ripple or XRP. Ito. So, sa XRP po, make sure na every time magta-transfer po kayo is you need to input the XRP wallet address and the destination tag. So, yung gagawin nyo lang po is i-copy nyo yung XRP wallet address nyo sa crypto.com. So, copy. And then, balik tayo sa coins.ph. And then, click natin yung send. Under send po is, click natin yung enter XRP address. So, dito. So, send XRP address to. So, yung address po is i-copy-paste na natin. So, paste. So, yung destination tag, balik tayo sa crypto.com Then copy the destination tag, copy. Then balik tayo sa coins. So to. Then continue. So yung amount po is lalagay lang natin is 10.74 Again, pa natin ng 1. Okay. So, makikita nyo po is yung fee lang ng XRP is 0 0.000045 XRP. So, mababa lang yung fee niya pag-transfer. So, I understand. And then, click to confirm. So, nandito po is mag-send po si coins.ph ng email. So, open natin yung email. Ito. So, copy lang po natin yung code. Then, balik po tayo sa coins.ph. Then, paste. So, status po natin is pending pa. So, it may take at least 3 to 5 minutes po bago makonfirm siya sa blockchain. So, back to wallet na po tayo. So, mapapansin nyo na bawas na po yung 
balance po natin sa XRP. So ngayon po is mag-wait na lang po tayo na ma-confirm siya at ma-verify sa blockchain. Then marireceive na po natin siya dito sa crypto.com. So yun na po. Na-receive na po natin yung deposit na XRP. So refresh lang po natin. Okay, so XRP deposit request is confirmed. So, nag-email po si Crypto.com na confirm na po. So, ngayon, uh, under accounts, look for Ripple. Okay, so nandito na po yung Ripple na na-transfer natin. So, since na-transfer na po natin yung Ripple is, the next step is, kailangan nating ibenta yung Ripple. And then, sell it to Crypto.com coin. So, since yung limit po is 50 XRP, so hindi ko po siya makoconvert. Say, na-convert nyo na po yung uh, XRP to CRO or Crypto.com token, pumunta na po kayo sa Crypto.com coin. So, let's say nandito na yung balance nyo. So, ang gagawin nyo is, isi-sell nyo din ulit. So, sell. Nandito po is, Sell CRO2. So, choose lang po nyo is yung MCO. So, once i-click nyo yung confirm, ayun na po. Magkakaroon na po kayo ng MCO, which is pwede nyo na pong i-stake for your card application. Yun lang po. So, if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. I'll try to answer those questions. And if you haven't subscribed yet, kindly hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more updates. Salamat po. God bless.